people say, for you know, Jamba, that thing is not fertile as in like that. You can use pure this sand and that thing germinates. Once it is germinated, it is pure responding now to move them to the next stage. That is now the potting site here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So once uh, they are ready here, we do the potting, this is the potting shed. That normally assists our staff so that you know, they, they cannot be overheated by them. Otherwise, sun, sun, when they do this given activity. So you fill in your pots. You've got various sizes. This was made basically for DS trees. DS trees takes a lot of time to be ready for out, out, outside planting. So you have to give them a good, a, a big food reserve. So this can task, in Changa, this one has to be fertile because they take time. Mm -hmm. Then we've got uh, the size, the, the other normal size, that one, that is six mm -hmm. by four. Mm -hmm. For these other exotic species, that takes around between six up to one year, mm -hmm. we're gonna do the planting. So once they're ready here, you've done the picking out from there, you bring them to this given area now, they start you know, establish themselves, but we allow minimal amount of around half of light inside here because they're still very tender if you allow a lot of it they'll be scorched and uh, we'll, we'll be losing at the end of the day so we don't allow that once they're, they're, they've grown a little bit from the amount of so <coughs> you move them to the next stage this one now you increase the amount of light again 75 percent yeah 75 percent they're able now to pick up they come they start adding adding off a little bit then once that one is done also a, a month or two months you move them now outside there they are able to withstand now those harsh conditions in terms of light, in terms of uh, <coughs> in terms of even water. Because once they are here now, we start the process of hardening off. Hardening off is preparing all those different seedlings to be ready for planting in the field. You know, planting in the field, you will not be doing the watering on a daily basis. Neither will you be adding uh, fertilizer, those other things. So what normally happens here in this watering? If you been doing it on on on, on either in the morning and also in the evening, you will probably just pick in the morning or in the evening alone. Then till the following day for the, all the all the species. Once that one is done, we will ensure that once this this given seedlings uh, are gonna plant them out there, they'll not depend so much on maybe the watering that you used to have. Yeah, so they'll be able to establish. That's our.